Hello everybody, today I'm in another room. Uh, the one that we looked at with the five can lights, with the one burned out, is on the other side of that wall there. There's also another room with five on the other side of this wall. So this is a room in between, and this one only has two uh, can lights in it. But the interesting thing is one of them, I think, is a Westinghouse bulb inside of it, where the other one is the Sylvania that we've seen in the other can lights in the other room. So, let's see what these switches do. That seems to only do the lights. I think there used to be a can light in the middle there where that fluorescent is because that one's different than all the others. So let's try the end switch. Apparently that only turns that on. So the middle one must do the can lights. Here we go. I don't hear them doing anything. Let me turn on all the lights and see if that starts them up. Or they're just disconnected. They very well could be. Maybe they're not hooked up anymore. But this has a very nice, it's not, I guess it isn't a Westinghouse. It's actually a uh, nice Sylvania clear top. You can see there, you can see the etch. It says Sylvania 100 watt. And then what I can't really tell what the bottom codes are. Oh wait, it's trying to start. I guess they are hooked up. They're just uh, very old bulbs. But this is a very unique one here. I think it's BT25 in shape. That's also what the other ones are, but this is the more uh, unique, or I think the cooler shape than these down here that the other can lights all have. So I guess the bulbs are just so old that they're burned out. But of course, mercury vapor doesn't really burn out. Arc tubes just get really black and then they can't really start anymore. Well, we saw this one try to start, but I guess it's just not going to do it for us today. So anyway, I'm going to zoom out here. Here we can have another look. The nice old Sylvania clear top in this can light. Uh, the replacement trough fixture here for probably a can light was there, I think, because it doesn't match any of the other fixtures. And the other can light down here with its pretty common, or original, I want to say, bulb. But I do believe that this bulb down here might be a true original, because it seems to be older than the others. Well, anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video of the second room with the mercury vapor can lights, or whatever the heck I end up titling this. Once again, I hope you enjoyed, and also please comment, rate, and subscribe, and thank you very much for watching.